missed the guest while we were away, sadly, but he left his hat here for us. Oh, really? Yes, indeed. Now, to test your analytical powers, Watson, take it and tell me what you observe. Well, it seems to me be made of some good material. Good craftsmanship, too. Handmade, maybe. Well, it would appear that the owner of this hat was in a very good financial state. Very, very good, Watson. Now, if I may add to that a bit. Uh, let's see here. Mm, very good, Watson. Uh, taking account of the make, age, expense, uh, expense, uh, etc., etc. I believe that indeed our visitor is very financially sound, coming from a rich family. Judging by the manufacturer, he's been living in Canada for quite some time. He's returned to England, most likely due to inheritance, but a complication has arisen from it, forcing him to seek our assistance. And also, he is unmarried. But how the devil do you get that from just a hat? Well, Watson, you saw the hat, but I observed it. I come to you, Holmes, on an important manner. My uncle was found dead outside his manor in Dartmoor, of a heart attack, supposedly. I'm next in line to inherit his manor. You suspect murder of your dear uncle, and that you are next. You should know, Holmes, that a terrible, terrible curse runs in our family. A hound is said to stain our family history. With all due respect, Mr. Baskerville, I doubt that your uncle was killed by a beast of superstitious imagination. Holmes, my uncle's body was found near the footprints of a massive hound. Look! Singular. You say that about everything. Well, this is really singular. The devil's agents may be of flesh and blood, may they not? Baskerville, I don't think you should go out to the moors tonight. I, I must, Watson, for you see, my beloved is out there. Love and fear are not incompatible emotions, Watson. Remember that. My uncle is dead. There's an ancient curse after me, and that my left shoe has been stolen. We are dealing with the most formidable foe, Watson. He may even manage to outmaneuver me. God help us all, then. I'm not a fool. I'm a doctor. We all agree. It was a huge creature. Luminous, ghastly, and spectral. I have cross-examined these men who all tell the same story of this dreadful apparition. Exactly corresponding to the Hellhound of Legend. I assure you, there is a reign of terror in the district, and it is hardly a man who will cross the moor at night. Who done it? Well, you see, it's elementary, Watson. Look here, the patterns of the footprints. There was obviously a struggle here. But where's your... My what? What happened to you? Never mind. <laughs>